It's a great time of year. It's in fact the time of year to get your seeds in the ground. Felix Catrone at Hicks Nurseries is showing us how to do just that. First, start with a seed starter like this. This seed tray, it comes with cells for individual plants, a tray to collect water, and then of course, it comes with a greenhouse top. Pour in your soil, smooth it out so all the cells are filled. If you have kids in the house, he says get their hands dirty too. It's, it's awesome when I see my grandkids planting a couple bean seeds and then a few months later enjoying those beans. We're going to start with green beans. Beans are a great seed to, for kids. Seeds are huge, so it's easy for them to handle. Since the seed is so big, he says to just put one in each cell and give it a little push down. Then we're going to take a little soil and cover them up. Okay, then of course we have to water them and Felix says we have to give it a nice good soaking. We're going to go over twice here. Felix, tell me when it looks yeah, good It looks to you. good, man. Your technique is perfect. Oh, thank you. Okay. <laughs> and put the cover on to create a greenhouse effect. Then put it on a nice, bright windowsill. When the surface of the soil dries and becomes a little crusty, that's when we want to water it again. As the seeds grow, you might want to raise the cover, and you can do that simply by putting four pencils in the corner and then rest it on the pencils. It still gives it nice warm, but doesn't encroach on its growth. These are going to go to the, my windowsill, I can tell you that. Oh, good.